How you guys doing today? Welcome to the Calhoun Chronicles. If you have a problem, I can fix it. Today, we're going to focus on Theater in Memphis. Um, Theater in Memphis is located in Memphis, Tennessee. Kind of in the East Memphis area by um, the Old Court Mall, if you guys are familiar with Memphis. All about the University of Memphis. Home of those Memphis Tigers. Go Tigers, go. Alright. Well, they came to me saying, Jeremy, we need help. Our social media team sucks. And we need some improvement. So, you know, I did. What I always do. Make it happen. So, after a lot of research, I came up with Jeremy's Ten Commandments for Theater Memphis. Theater Memphis, this is for you. So, check this out. The first one. The first suggestion I will give you guys is to homogeneously in sync. That means I need you to combine your marketing strategy and your social media strategy together. Combine them as one. As you go, as you move along in the process, when you set up how you want to market yourselves, please include your your social media strategy as well. Social media such as Twitter, Facebook, Instagram are becoming one of the main ways that you can communicate with each other. It's taking over. It's taking over the telephone. Taking over text messages. I know people. My mama she don't even call me no more. She Facebook being stayed. That's just how crazy it is with social media. So plan to sync your marketing strategy and your social media strategy, strategy together and watch it do wonders. The second recommendation is legacy and tradition. Now to my understanding, Theater Memphis is the longest run home. Let me get it right, so I don't want to mess up. See, I've been to Memphis, they don't play, so let me get this right. Theater Memphis is the longest running community theater company in the Mid-South. Hmm. The longest running community theater in the Mid-South. Use your legacy. You've been there since 1921. Memphis has changed a whole lot since 1921. That's 2013. And one thing that's consistent in Memphis has been theater in Memphis. Use that to your advantage. Post it on your, on your social media, on your Twitter, on your Facebook, on your Instagram. And how at that? Another thing that stuck out, that stuck out about that comment was Longest running community. Emphasize that word community. And start to build a tradition that you, that you guys care about the about the you know the community that, that you guys are around that East Memphis area. Now hotbed we have all type of restaurants. Take advantage of that. Put it on your Instagram, on your Twitter, on your Facebook. The third recommendation, intimacy. Show your consumers some love. As I was researching, I saw that you guys were on Facebook, on Twitter, and you had you said all these nice little statuses, posted all these nice pictures, and yeah, your customers that went in there they comment, oh how I love Theater Memphis, I love Theater Memphis, and what you do? You didn't even you didn't even reply to them. There were no Theater Memphis posts to reply and interact with your customers. Please do that. Show them some love. Write them back using the Theater Memphis page so it can kind of feel like. Like the Memphis actually responded to them. Might need some justice. Fourth recommendation is get you a star player. Now I would do it, but I charge and I'm not cheap. So I know I would set I would set you guys' social media off. Cause I'm Jeremy. Calhoun. But I can't do that. You guys have the Memphis Grizzlies. You guys have the Memphis Tigers. You if you can get someone like Zach Randolph. Like Joe, Z like Joe Jackson, like Mark Gasol, who just won NBA Defensive Player of the Year. Yeah, he just won that. So to highlight and promote and just kind of express his, his love and affection for Theater Memphis, I guarantee you, people will show up. And if you have a, a day where he come and he and he just watches the play and he says, "I'll be there, 7:30, Theater Memphis, be there, and come watch a play with me." Yeah, you might have people who come to the play just to see Marcus All, or just to see Zach Randolph, or just to see Joe Jackson, but they're also going to be there to see the play as well. Use it. Get you, some, get you a star player. The next one is the fourth one, and which, is the, which is the fifth one, I'm sorry. The Steve Jobs Syndrome. You have to get creative. You have to be bold. When Steve Jobs got the Apple, it was alright. When he came in, he revolutionized Apple. With these little phones that we have today. This little this little thing right here. He was creative and he was bold. Get bold with your social media. Do things that no one else is doing. Don't be afraid to take chances. 
do a roll call. Have context. Do anything and everything that's going to be bold, that's going to be daring, and do it. You can only cause excitement. Don't be afraid to be bold. Extra. Oh, the fifth recommendation. I'm moving the sixth. I'm moving fast. Sorry. The sixth recommendation is extra, extra. Tell all about it. Show your customers some love. From my understanding, the theater Memphis prides itself on having a strong performance and having a good crowd interaction. Let your let your let your customers and your audience express that visually and verbally by saying, "When I was at theater Memphis, I had this. When I was at theater Memphis, it was this." There's some good things about you. Let them tell it. The seventh thing is word of mouth. Where you at? Let let your users check in. I know it's kind of creepy because of privacy and all that, but hey, if they're on the way to 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 theater Memphis, let them post it. Let them tag their location, where they can see the in, the major intersections where theater Memphis is at. It might help for future shows. Also, just because it's Wednesday, which is the eighth recommendation, and basically just reward and acknowledge all the people that follow you, that show theater Memphis love. And you can do it on your on your Instagram. You can do it on your Twitter. Just highlight them and say, oh. This is Crystal Seymour. She's been to Theater Memphis five times. This is what she loves about it. And this is her war for following us. Boom. Just that simple. Spotlight. Do a customer spotlight. Some of your loyal customers. Let, let, let them be the celebrity for the night. Give them free tickets. Put them in the spotlight. Put them on your Instagram, your Facebook, and your Twitter. Last thing is take it up a notch. You guys' websites suck. Theater Memphis, the org sucks. Spice it up, please. And that's it. I can't get y'all no more unless y'all can pay me. That's my recommendation. Calhoun Chronicles, Theater Memphis. If you do all 10 of those things, I ain't gonna need me no more. Y'all gonna pay me. I ain't give y'all nothing else. That's simple. 